Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, Jin here. I'm on the go again, I am driving. <laughs> so anyway, I am going to uh, meet my friends. We are having like a lunch, you know. Uh, my friend, we haven't had, we haven't done uh, a get together for, for quite some time. So we're going back to our favorite restaurant, uh, the uh, Suki. Of course, guys, it's not a paid uh, promotion, <laughs> but that's just our favorite uh, place to go, and so we're going for uh, for lunch. You see, so meantime, I went ahead and decided I am going to have this one. Actually, I was thinking of doing just uh, uh, tasting for all my uh, Turkish delis that I get from Chicago, but then I was thinking, man, that's a lot. Twelve of them that I'll be tasting. So I won't be able to like, uh, I will be able to see what really it tastes like. So I'm thinking, hmm, why don't I just do it one at a time? So this is my very first uh, tasting for my uh, turkey delish from Chicago, the uh, Mediterranean store. So I think this is the uh, this is the apricot. So I'm gonna see what it tastes like. Cause I was thinking, you know, it's only the it's all it's a little bit early so I might as well have my own tasting. <laughs> so here. Oh I can't even get it open. So I'm thinking that you know having this I know some somebody's calling me guys, I'm not answering it for now. But here, this is my first tasting for my candies that I got from the uh from Chicago, one of my one of my pasalobo. Huh? That's kind of a lot, but it looks like. Huh? But this is supposed to be the apricot. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. This is interesting. It's kind of almost like. A, okay. The texture, guys. Here's the texture. It's kind of folded. It's not marmalade, but it's thicker than marmalade. But it always—it's gonna almost have that taste, orangey taste. It almost tastes like uh, it's supposed to be apricot, right? But uh, it's gonna taste like um, orange marmalade. So, hmm. And it's almost like it's not that the. the uh, it's I like it, guys. The it's not so sweet. It's almost like uh, marmalade. Hmm. Biko is like flour. Okay, maybe I should say. It's almost like the texture. It's almost like... Um, um, what was I going to say? It's almost like... Um, you know, like it? Yeah, thicker than my like it. With the marmalade. Or cooked in marmalade. Hmm. There's somehow it's good, but somehow there is like a distinct smell. It's probably one of the spices. It's alright. I mean, I like the texture. I like that it's not very sweet, even though it's candy, supposedly. Let me see, I have to watch what I'm doing too. <laughs> so, even though it's supposed to be like a candy, but it's not very sweet. So, that's the part that I like. But other and the you know like I said the sweetness like a balance sweetness to it that's what I like and there's a little bit of a bitterness to it I don't know what it is <laughs> but it's good what my what I don't like too much is the I mean you don't smell it I can't smell anything but when you eat them there's a distinct scent maybe like a Instead of vanilla, it's something. Uh oh. It's like a. I don't know. It's, it, it reminds me of like a. You know, the scent of the ocean with a fishy scent. <laughs> That's what it smells like. I mean, smelling it, it doesn't smell that way, what I was describing. But when you taste it, 
when you put it in your mouth you can you can taste all the different the bitterness this a slight bitterness sweetness to it and that special scent I don't know what it is but of course I'm I'm willing to taste the uh, Turkish maybe it's coming like that but anyway it's 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 pretty much it's overall I used to say overall it's okay I like it but if I have to write it's just probably just five it's because I'm not fan of the certain uh, scent that is infused into the candy so so far guys I'll take that <laughs> so I know I don't know I'm still kind of trying to of course I'm not a connoisseur of any of every different kind of taste or flavor I'm just eating it because you know it's, it's part of what I would like to taste but uh, other than that it's all right all I can say it's all right you know I'm a Filipino I don't have the Mediterranean taste I think I believe with the spices that they have but this is not my favorite like I said it overall is just all right it's all right but I eat the mongols, that's all that matters, right? <laughs> so, anyway. Anyway, it's another, I always say that. Um, one of my friends, um, I don't know if you guys, so if some of you have seen of uh, one of my vlogs or my video about the, uh, um, I think the title was uh, Officially Retired. Since uh, we had, uh, oh, we had a we had a dinner also a dinner or a lunch for our retired friend then so anyway her husband died about uh, two weeks ago when I was in Chicago so um, that's one of the things that you know sometimes you don't know what happened when you get live out of town and so uh, we are having dinner today with some of my girlfriends also kind of like uh, you know support our friend but that's what we do so um, and also um, update with my sister you know I have a lot of things to talk right <laughs> a lot of things to talk about today so let me see I have to I have to watch where I'm going guys and for my uh, there you go. then I can go now for my stoplight and sometimes when I get to talking I talk a lot <laughs> surprise right but anyway uh, my sister's update uh, they I think I have mentioned that maybe I haven't but she's taking a uh, one day at a time I was hoping that you know I'll be able to uh, go back to Chicago but it's, it's still up in the air guys because of you know I need to work too right so let's see what happened maybe next month I'll go back to Chicago um, we'll just see what happened but so far uh, she said that um, she's still a little pain here and there but you know she gets out of the house and you know how it is when you get out of the house you don't think of the pain so um, and then when she goes to get back home and she's all by herself then she starts feeling the pain that's kind of normal right uh, but other than that she is pretty much recovering well so like I said there's a lot of things going on you know uh, friends uh, husbands died you know uh, my sisters uh, health issues but like I said so far we probably uh, more than likely there's a big percentage that she might not have to have chemo so that's a good part right so anyway uh, now I'm going to my I'm going to like have a little fun just so you know get together with friends again and um, I will show well I will take you over there maybe guys this time I'm hoping that I'll be able to oh my goodness I just forgot my <laughs> I just forgot my tripod but I was thinking that I'll be able to uh, to cover a lot of the because we are gonna be in the Hibachi so I was hoping that I can cover a lot of uh, uh, clips you know because they last time they uh, the the chef sh he was doing like a volcano eruption and things like that in front of you a lot of entertainment so to speak so 
I'm hoping we are gonna have that so I will just show you some of it guys also before I have an accident right <laughs> but and I'm close anyway so I'm just gonna go uh, get a park and then I will see you guys soon I just got here and they don't open till 11 o'clock so uh, let's see I'm not sure if my friends already here and if not I'll go ahead and get the table guys so I think we're gonna be sitting one of this table there for the hibachi but my friends is not here yet so guys I'm the only one here for now there's four of us so I'm just gonna uh, tea green tea is that okay do you have green tea okay sure no no rush no rush okay thank you so guys I thought I'm the only one that went early here I thought I was one of the early birds but there's already a whole family on the other table that got here also at the same time that I got here. So there they are on the other side of the table and they're putting their orders already. Wow. So yeah, this is kind of like fun place to eat really. Yeah, this is the name of the place guys, Tsuki. It's actually, it's this Japanese um, restaurant that's actually managed and owned by a Filipino. Mm -hmm. Right there, that is their hot plate, guys. I guess, I guess probably it's August, it's, it's kind of getting warmer here, and it will start smoking up here in a few. But then, the of course, the place, the restaurant will not be uh, really smoking because they have a huge um, exhaust that will kind of like, you know, suck up the, the smoke up. And then, um, I'm just going to show you, it's hard for me to explain, right? <laughs> See from there, the smoke will kind of just go up there and then it goes right here. And I'm sure a lot of you already knows how this works. Because I think we have, I haven't been in the Philippines, but I, I mean, I've been to the Philippines, but I haven't been in any of the like Japanese restaurant in the Philippines, but some of you guys probably have. But yeah, that's a huge uh, exhaust fan there that will kind of uh, bring the smoke straight up and be, uh, you know, set outside, of course, of the building. <laughs> so that's, hey, what an explanation, right? <laughs> and I like their decor also. I don't know if my uh, friends, they're still not here yet. I guess I'm the prompt one in the, in the bunch. <laughs> There they are. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay. I got, here, I got a ride at uh, 11 o'clock when they open. And then she, that's what she's saying. She forgot. <laughs> she twisted my arm. Well, yeah. Can I just go ahead and record that? Yes. <laughs> it's <laughs> See, that's our next door. Next door is our table, guys. But they already have their own. Uh, they're fixing their own. <laughs> I am so telling you. I just. It's, it was written all over your face. <laughs> he just. <laughs> Joe. Oh, it's a joke. Yeah, you know me. Yeah. I was making some bunny. What's up? <laughs> but, but it's not it's a Japanese cholesterol but he's a he's a vocation <laughs> Colombia, Colombia, Colombia. Happy drive, 
First time here, eh? No wonder she cannot drink the whole vodka. <laughs> Somebody order one to go. Can you have to go? Okay. Yes, sir. No problem. No problem. But the, the thing is, I can tell you believe me, didn't you? No, I believe you. I believe you. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I believe you. <laughs> They need, they need all that whatever you whatever you gave them last time. Why you did not why did not show us off you how to make your volcano? Oh my goodness, I was waiting for that all day long. I get up got up at five o'clock. I mean I took about four. Four o'clock. So that I can have the uh, volcano. So that's Dina's uh, plate, and she still, he's the the chef still have to get uh, the meat, yeah. And this is mine. I have the crunchy shrimp roll. So the chef will go ahead make a volcano just for me. <laughs> There you go. That's the meat part. All right. And then the volcano. Come on, volcano. All right. All right. It's a special request. I get up at four o'clock. Yeah. Shrimp and scallop and shrimp and then chicken. And then right there, see, right here is the beef steak. All right, she's making, making up the volcano, prepping the volcano. Yeah. Yeah, you forgot that? Okay. See, it's kind of part of the treat. See, look at that. Watch A. There's the Alright, look at that. Wow. See? See, look at that. Isn't that so fancy? Eh? Watch out our eyebrows. Yeah. Woo! <laughs>
<laughs> I like that. You had it. Hey, you had it going longer. That's good. Thank you so much. I'm sorry. No, thank you. I'm sorry. It's all right. You want a little bit of onion? Onion is supposed to be good for you. Yeah. Yeah. You should put, did you have, did you order that, bro? Oh, you change it? Okay. You know, you know when the little young young says to go? Thank you. So guys, um, that was uh, that was a, a very very good uh, dinner, dinner lunch. <laughs> so it's like we stay there for about uh, one, two, eleven, twelve. It's about two hours, two and a half hours. And also, I met another Filipina. She works there at the at Suki. So I had uh, that's all what I actually. Most of my friends had a um, hibachi, and I had the uh, uh, crunchy rolls, which is like uh, actually it's a, a crunchy, crunchy shrimp rolls. It's like a, a cooked version of sushi. So my my back hurts now. I'm sorry, guys. So anyhow, that is what I you know my today so far. It's pretty much taken like five hours altogether in my day because we were there at the um, we were there at the restaurant for like two hours just kind of catching up with friends you know bonding and things like that and then after that we went to uh, Mama Veda's house and kind of visit with her with her so uh, it is now just turned three o'clock yeah three o'clock <laughs> so um, uh, pretty much, you know, uh, bonding with friends, uh, of course, my uh, tasting also, guys, with my candies, my uh, Turkish delish, how oh, that's supposed to be, it was supposed to be an apricot, <laughs> but anyhow, it wasn't bad, other than that, everything went well with the dinner, and I mean dinner, I always keep seeing dinner, with the lunch, lunch with friends, and so um, another day is over or pretty much I am now heading to uh, to the store get some of my uh, grocery shopping so I appreciate you guys uh, watching <laughs> and viewing uh, watching my vlogs and I see you guys soon oh real quickly also is a little bit of a shout out to my friends my newly uh, met friends when I was in Chicago uh, from Hiromi's and you know who they are you guys know who you are uh, shout out to my Chicago friends Ned uh, Mario Mel Michael my sister my aunt and also friends from Australia <clears throat> friends from uh, Denmark Copenhagen uh, friends from the Philippines <laughs> shout out guys i haven't done a shout out for like oh, for in forever seems like it so today i just kind of have the feel for it so shout out to the viewers and also to my silent viewers guys i have like a little i need a little bit more to get my subscribers to a 5000 and then we are going to have our um uh <clears throat> excuse me another draw i should do some live also soon but for now that's my shout out to viewers and silent viewers in cebu manala makate yeah i always have i always does my silent viewers in makate also and uh let me see in tapilisan and oh uh, cotabato yeah cotabato davao del norte what else? Nueva Ecija. Uh, I'm doing like this. <laughs> so, uh, Florida. Uh, uh, Florida. 
what else uh, alabama norway oh japan also japan uh, viewers in japan so you guys have a good uh, have a good week and i will see you guys soon thank you so much for watching bye